Look at me now. <laughs> and so I'm uh, a bit unsure where we last left off. Quite unfortunate indeed. Richard probably uh, ran away during the fighting. As he uh, seems to do lately. I think that he has found me uh, unable to protect him. I find this quite sad. But the Imperial power was quite strong. Brandar's power, not so much. Ah, come to me, Dragonfly. Yes, nice. This looks like a house ahead. But it does not look like uh, there are friendly inhabitants there. Hmm, we will need to be quite careful. I think she is some sort of witch, yes? But she does not see Brandar coming. Let's see if we can get the jump on her. Hmm. How about... Just like so. Please stop moving. Don't want to alert her to my presence. Yet. Ha! Ah. And I've missed gloriously, of course. Back, back, back. Yes, keep your hands aglow so Brandar can see you, witch lady. Hmm. And another miss. My nerves seem to have been rattled by that dragon. Hmm, but not so much. <laughs> Able to take her down with one fell blow. Ah, and a rather nice backpack. I believe it is equivalent to Brandar's. Hmm. All she seems to have for me are some some robes, which might sell quite nice at market. Hmm. Quite a place this is, huh? What a home. She needs some housekeeping done, I do think. Hmm. Skulls everywhere. Hag raven feathers, yes. She was probably one of the, uh... One of the bird women. Hmm? I didn't see any feathers on her, but uh, perhaps she pulled them all out, yes? At least she has a nice chest for Brandar to look through. <laughs> ah, enough of this. I must be off. This is the, uh, the, the mountain that the dragon was circling. So I must wonder what he was guarding at the top. Or perhaps what he was terrorizing at the top. Hmm, we shall see. Given enough time, all will be revealed. And perhaps we might find Richard as well. Ah, that poor boy. You know, he's got a... Quite a, a set of nerves. Very high tension, that one. But who could blame him, living as a prey animal? Brandar has never experienced such things. He's always been the hunter, never the hunted. So who's to say? Perhaps if Brandar were the hunted, he would also be a skittish one. But as it is, there's not much that I fear. Hmm. I don't see an easy way to get to the top of this mountain. But on the plus side, there is a uh, much dragon tongue here. Perhaps we could make a uh, fire potion of sorts. Fire resistance, something like this. Ah, here we are. I can only wonder what awaits me at the top. Perhaps this is where Richard sought refuge, although I doubt that. Any person uh, with their wits about them would run in the exact opposite direction. But Brandar's wits are rarely about him, huh? <laughs> ah, I jest, you see. Because Brandar finds himself quite witty. As I hope do you, friends. Hmm, look at all of these. What is this place? An uh, elephant graveyard, I do think. But nothing lies in the coffins. Ah, but here, a chest. 
Most wondrous. Ah, the shield seems to resist magic. That could be quite useful, hmm? And now I'm carrying a bit too much. Hmm. Might as well load it down even more, I suppose. Do I really need all of this ore? I suppose not. Hmm. Nord arrows, long bow. Ah! Shore grip bracers! Doing more damage with two-handed weapons. Ah, Brandar's never been much for the uh, berserking, you know. There are quite a few nice enchanted things in here. Staff of Fury. Circlet of Conjuration. Ah, and now I must store some things, I do think. Hmm, what have we here? Ingots? Yes. We will store this ore as well. Dragon bone, dragon scales. Hmm, quite heavy. I don't want to store them quite yet. We shall store most of the ore. I think this is what is holding me down so much. Horker tusks. Hmm. I thought that I might be able to use them in some ingredients, but it seems not. Never the matter. I shall carry them around for just a bit longer. My precious loot? Hmm. I don't see myself uh, smithing much armor. I must learn a bit more of this smithing. And I think that I might remember this place. And if somebody else comes and uh, stumbles upon these things, so be it, huh? No matter. And what is this? Oh my goodness. Another whispering wall. Hello to you! Oh. And this is probably what called the dragon here, huh? Shouting about its frost breath to whoever may be listening. Let me tell you, friend, the whole world is listening. Might want to uh, tone it down just a little bit. Hmm, I think this is the Mistwatch Keep. Ah. It seems only mountains that way. Ah. Perhaps my feet have misled me this time. It might be about time to turn around. Although I'd hate to uh, go back to Windhelm with my tail between my legs. Asking for help. Hmm. They should think that I'm, uh... Not deserving of staying in Skyrim if I don't even know the landscape, hmm? I think that Galmar uh, assumed quite a bit about Brandar. Perhaps that he has lived here for quite some time and would be able to find the Corvan Jund without much help. Ah. Unfortunate that. I would not like to ask the Stormcloaks. Perhaps, uh. I could find a friendly village or something. Offload some of my wares, kick my feet up for a while. Yes, I think this could be rather nice. I did hear another dragonfly, huh? Where do you go? Ah. I'm unsure what I shall do with all of these dragon's tongue flowers. Surely they shall come in handy at some point. I should make myself some fire-resist potion should I run across another thorntail dragon. But I am to presume there are many different types of dragons out here in the wilderness. The one we fought just now did not seem similar to the one we had fought before. Hmm? A little bit different. Darkwater Crossing. Ah, hello to you. I used to be an adventurer in my day. Then I settled down, got married. Congratulations, uh, tell me about your adventures. That's right. I used to explore all over. I'm the one who originally found the mine Darkwater Crossing was built around. Hmm. I was actually scouting a bit the other day, old time's sake. Spite a brigand heading back to his camp. A How brigand? My husband is being a sad stick, so I can't go myself. Well, I uh, don't have the time right now. I would like to clear this land of brigands, though. 
Hmm. I'm on another quest for uh, Corvan Jund. Part of the Stormcloaks, you understand? So, uh, do you know anything about Corvan Jund? You're just going to stare at me blankly? Okay, maybe another time then. Fair enough. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Quite. I wonder if they should have a shopkeep in this town, huh? Hmm. Darkwater Crossing. Pleased to meet you, Darkwater Crossing. I am Brandar. Seems there is nothing for me to do here. Quite a few little settlements. Hmm. Quite a few flowers, which is always nice. Ah, hello to you, elf. I cannot uh, cross the fence at the moment. Here for work? Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. Interesting. Uh, Randar's never been much of a lumberjack, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Well, I suppose he's looking for wood, you see? Unfortunately, I uh, don't have any at the moment. But we take some chicken eggs. Yes. This is quite a nice little farm they have here. Brandar will harvest these things. So helpful he is. And then maybe someday I will even uh, bring them back to you, you know? Perhaps in the form of a potion or something that could be useful to you. As it is, these things, hmm, not very good. I shall take them off of your hands. Don't worry, thank me later. Goodbye! <laughs> he didn't think that I could jump the fence because I failed before. But look at me now. Dark water crossing. No one there seems to know anything of Corvan Jund. Hmm. Unfortunate. Ah, and now we are stuck between the crooks and the river. Perhaps there is uh, somewhere that I could cross. It's a bridge just there. Well, <laughs> I should avoid the sight of that elf. That lumberjack elf. Usually you don't think that elves uh, would be one for the physical labor, but you might be surprised every once in a while. People usually assume that the Khajiit is a, a thief or some sort of brigand. But Brandar is a bard, spreading happiness and joy to all. People don't usually expect that. Especially since uh, we don't have the best grasp on the common tongue. Oh my, fellow Khajiit, why do you do this? You approach so quickly, hmm? Oh. How's that? Oh, this is not working. Well, I've given up on the two-handed. Yes, I did think this was a one-handed weapon when I pulled it out. No matter. We shall switch deftly. Haha! -ha! And now you burn! How's that? Fearless assassin that you are, huh? <laughs> no match for Brandar. Even though you do have some Khajiit pride. A shame that. She was kind of cute, was she not? Oh, and she brings with her a note. Wonderful. We shall have a read. Hmm. There are some shoulder pads. I don't know if I'd like to wear them, simply because people might get the, uh, the wrong idea about Brandar. Think that I am part of the Dark Brotherhood or some such. Hmm. I shall take it. I shall consider wearing it, at least, uh, into combat. I must take it off when I am in a town, though. Wouldn't want to upset the fine people, hmm? Let us see what this book says. It's a book, no? As instructed, you are to eliminate Brandar by any means necessary. The Black Sacrament has been performed. Somebody wants this poor fool dead. We've already received payment for the contract. Failure is not an option. Signed by Astrid. Hmm, I don't much appreciate that Astrid. Sending one of my own after me. 
Shameful. And I had to put her down like a dog. Hmm. So sad when that happens. I've seen so many assassins coming after me. Is it because I've joined the Stormcloaks? Is it because I've uh, abandoned the Emperor somewhat? It's so hard to tell. People might want Brandar's head for so many reasons. Hmm? How about you, Wolfie? Brandar wants your head. <laughs> and this. No problem. Deftly dealt with. Swiftly and deftly. Ivarstead up that way. Well, I suppose I would like to have a look in another town. See if there is uh, something for me here. Oh, it's so steep. Hmm. My legs, they grow weary from outrunning the dragon. Oh, and now the rain comes. Ah. <sighs> Alas. I do have something that might help me out here. My hood. Wonderful. Now Brandar needn't fear the rain as much. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.